So let us see a few requirements. Property display, checkbox or drop down. Now you would ask me what do I mean by this. Now many of my clients they have said that the property value should be in a checkbox kind of a cosmetic look or a drop down. So let me show you what do I mean exactly. This is my new center service desk. This is me, Adi Kosh. I've given myself as an administrative rights. Now I would log in into service desk. That's taking time. <laughs> now over here, when I click on the administration tab, many of you would know who have been working on service desk as an administrator or a consultant. Now when I click on service desk, go to request incident problem, click on area, there's categories and then click on applications. Over here, I can see the property. It says IDE. Now what do I mean by this is that the label of the property should say IDE and the user should get two options to select from. That is DD visuals. DD stands for drop down and the options would be Visual Studio 2008.NET or NetBeans. So let me give you an example. I'm creating a new incident over here. Okay. Just bear with me. The system is slow. Now when I click on incident area. And I select applications. And then I will scroll down and click on the properties tab. I'll get this IDE and it will give me two options to select from. Either I can select Visual Studio 2008.NET or I can select NetBeans. Similarly, I can make it a kind of a checkbox. All I would need to do is that just click on any category which I want. Then click on the Add Property tab and just add this CB. It stands for checkbox. So instead of that drop down, you would see a checkbox on which you put a check mark or not. Say, like this scenario would be like uh, um, whether it's a first time color, yes or no. So just click on it. Whether it's a uh, level 1 support or level 2 support. So just click. If it's not a level 2 support, don't put a check mark. Now, the second requirement that is property search. Now, over here, if I click on tickets by property, I just tap some percentage, some value, I'll get all these property values. This is the ticket number, and these are the labels like test. I just get it in hardware, it says enter. So like for example over here the new incident which I created. I'll just select I'll just create a ticket okay to demonstrate. I'll select the affected end user. I will select Christy Campbell. She keeps on calling again and again. And I'll select on application area like the incident area applications. Just type on test. Test and click on save. It won't because I have to select the property which I've made it required. And I've selected the IDE. Crystal Campbell is using Visual, Stu Visual Studio 2008. in progress. Now I'll click on search. And here I've got it, Visual Studio 2008. So if I want to see to which category this property belongs, I can click on this. And if I want to see to which 